If you are looking to move to San Antonio, Texas, you may be curious on the best neighborhoods, the best houses to go ahead and choose from. I think I may have found that special gym for you, especially if you're looking for a one story floor plan. This is going to be four beds, two and a half bathrooms with 2000 square feet of living space situated on an oversized corner lot. Now the builder who is Perry Holmes is currently contributing $25,000 in closing costs and that can be used in a variety of three different ways or three ways simultaneously and we can go ahead and discuss that later on and on top of that this builder will be contributing all of the appliances as well including the gas range cooktop, the dishwasher, the stove, refrigerator, and blinds. Let's go ahead and dive in. Like I mentioned, corner lot, beautiful one-story home for the price of $425,000. This is a four bedroom, three bathroom home with a flex space. So let's go check this gorgeous Perry home out. gonna have the gorgeous tile at the entry of the home you're going to have your flex room which can definitely be used as an office man cave a gym whatever the case might be um, you're gonna have the six inch baseboards as well which is gonna be more uh, modern and elegant has that timeless feel to it Laundry room will be um, at the front of the house. You're gonna have some cabinets right here and uh, some rods. In the foyer, you will have your 12 foot ceilings as well. You're gonna see the craftsmanship in the ceilings and you're going to have your upgraded door. You're gonna have your garage at the front of the home, uh, two car, uh, yeah, two car garage, tankless water heater, and you're gonna have an irrigation system with an automatic garage door opener. And then in the kitchen, you're gonna be that white on white. There we go. That beautiful white quartz as well. Then you have some more nice features um, right here. Gorgeous backsplash. And it is going to come with a gas range cooktop, microwave, and a double stacked oven. You're going to have some cabinets right here for your island. Then we have your pantry, which does feature a light. So tons of space. And then I'm assuming this is going to be, well, it doesn't really count because I said it at the exact same the, at the exact same time that I saw saw it, but this is going to be the half bathroom uh, right here for your guests to go ahead and utilize. Got a nice light fixture hanging over the vanity. And then you are going to have the family room right here. Look at the windows in here. You're going to get three seven foot windows that lead out to the backyard. Then you get two six foot windows right there. But this right here is going to be your family room. You can either put the TV and entertainment on this wall or even on this wall. And then you can have a dining table right here. And this is ultimately gonna be known as your open concept. So right here will be the first bedroom. I just want y'all to see the angles. Then you have the double door to access the closet. And then you will have 
a thermostat at the front of the house. You can all touch screen. And then you're going to have a Jack and Jill style concept without the shared rooms. So towel rack, you get your vanity sink right here. You get your toilet and there's still tile flooring all throughout. Some linen closets. Uh, from right here, you can access the family room. But right off of the bathroom that we just came out of, you're going to have two rooms. And they are all gonna be about the same size as far as measurements go. Just want y'all to see the different angles. This is going to come with a walk-in closet. And then you'll have your last bedroom over here. We still have the primary bedroom that we still need to showcase. And right now, I'm just trying to get y'all different angles of every room so you can see um, the width and how big that these rooms are. And once again, whenever we come out, it'll bring us into our family room. Once again, this is 2000 square feet of living space and that's not including the garage. So we come outside, peaceful out here, gorgeous green grass. Look at how wide the yard is. And for your information, before you move in, this entire lawn will be cut before you move in. And look at all this space on the side on the side of your yard. You even get the masonry on the back of the home as well, um, also known as your brick. So you're gonna have four sided brick, front, side, and the back of the home. Pretty cool feature there. And now let's uh, head on into the primary bedroom. When we walk in, you pretty much double your bedroom size. And every, every ceiling is going to be pre-wired for a ceiling fan. So you're gonna save money on there if you do want to install uh, ceiling fans. You're gonna get three six foot windows in your primary. Then this sink right here is for my ladies. As you can tell, it's already equipped with the pull-out makeup drawer and a sit-down area. She's gonna get two light fixtures over her beautiful vanity mirror. And fellas, this right here is for us. As you can see, we have more of the, the simplicity. And you're also gonna get your separate garden tub and walk-in shower. Not that you would, but you can literally fit four people standing side by side in here. So pretty spacious shower with the tile backsplash. You're gonna have a bench area to sit down. Privacy window, towel rack. And then you're going to get the water closet because there's no need to be smelling all those foul aromas. Shut this and everyone's much more happier. And last but not least, the primary closet. And if you're ready to take this home off the market now, feel free to give us a call. Our phone number is at the bottom right corner of this video.